it's twenty dollars. Twenty dollars just for that? Yep, for yeah. a ride. I would love to. So we are heading I go on, a ride, on the outside mm. at Foundry Park. It's just, it's just a small ride. Yeah, I know, but. Well, I would love to go on it. I don't care. It's a small, slow ride. It yeah, I know, fun. but it's twenty dollars, Hannah. At I least wish. it has stuff about Foundry Park. Peek into the past, 1912. So yeah. We're outside in the Foundry Park area. That looks, that looks so fun. Looks like only a few people can go in at a time. Mm -hmm. and they are doing. Uh, they are doing rides on the little train here for uh, twenty dollars. I don't know if it's a person, but it's set up to two people. Well, we are in Foundry Park. So all it does is a small ride back and forth here. goes pretty much up to the end here and then right back up to the front here where the frog is at no <laughs> yep. anthracite iron furnace sites wow. oh wow this is in the lehigh valley area copley that's another place I want to go There's to Copley eventually. For the number five. And there's the wow. little train ride. There's a lot of iron furnaces on here. And I they stop right you're about really here. In, you're really interested. See, they, they load you up up there. There's also more signs over there, but. Thank you. You're welcome. Steel production. Ingot mold, hoisting engine, ladle. That's what those are called. They're called ladles. Yeah. Oh, it carried milk and steel. That's forging. Hem steel. That's a bending press over there, Hannah. I know. It's a big, huge thing. I didn't think this would make your. <laughs> you get to. Uh... That's an arc furnace right here in front of me. Oh. You guys should let him try and steer. Yeah. So you get a little bit of the experience there to control the actual little train here it looks like a switcher to me that's what that that's what they call these oh wow who is full, is full of water and there's parts here and there's more stuff on the yeah, other side as well well we can we yeah we can cross over once the train gets the other side why not do it now yes we are Charging machine. What did it do? It's, it's the type of machine that ran on rails parallel to the row of furnaces and picked up boxes, scrap alloys, and slag making materials from narrow from the narrow gauge railroad. Cool. And it would rotate the empty boxes into the furnace and repeat this process until the furnace was full. Cool. Oh wow. Cool. <laughs> Freaking thing keeps. <laughs> He's working on it, whatever it is right now. Yeah. Don't know what it is. 
There's some type of welding, I guess, on it. Pieces of actual Bethlehem steel. What this is that they're restoring. You can see they're trying to restore it. Yep. Moving around the plant. This is the hoist. Moving around the plant, and then this is what they, it's called a dinky locomotive. Standard gauge. Moving around the plant. We're going to have to wait until they move back again. The dinky locomotive. Scrap metal made to steel making furnaces. So that's basically what it would hold in there. Charging as a part of filling up steel furnace. All right. And their ride is over. <laughs>